I am Anil Kumar. Let me thank all the viewers and subscribers for watching my videos and posting excellent questions. Here is a request from one of our subscribers who want to understand concept of finding media in a group data. So I've taken up this excellent question from one of the previous test papers that will help us to understand median in a better way. The question here is, the median of the distribution given below is 14.4. Find the values of x and y if the sum of frequency is 20. So the class interval is given 0 to 6, 6 to 12, 12 to 18, 18 to 24, and 24 to 30. The frequencies respective to all are 4, x, 5, y, and 1. We're also given here that the sum of the frequency is equal to 20. Right. Now, the formula to find the median is given by median equals to lower limit of the class interval plus n by 2, the center value, the median, minus cumulative frequency over the frequency of the modal class times the class interval. So that's the formula which we are going to use. Now in this particular case, let us first find cumulative frequency, right? So let me make an additional column here. I'll just squeeze it in, cumulative frequency. Four, then when you add x, it becomes four plus x. Add five, nine plus x. Add y, it becomes nine plus x plus y. And when you add one, it becomes 10 plus x plus y. Okay. So, when the total is 20, that also tells you one more thing here, that 10 plus x plus y is 20, that means x plus y equals to 10. Clear? Now, let us try to understand the first statement. Median of the distribution given below is 14.4. Now, where will be 14.4? Now, as you can see, x plus y maximum could be 10. Even if I take y as 0, x can be 10, not more than that. So with 10, we can only get a value of 14 here, here right? Not 14.4. That clearly indicates that 14.4 should lie in this particular group. Perfect, because we are assuming it almost in the center, the group has a frequency of 5. So that becomes our modal class. Correct? So 14.4 will lie in 12 to 18. Now in this particular case, let's, we are all already given the median. So we are given median m equal to 14.4. Now we know all the figures, we can substitute the value and find the unknown, right? So here, m equals to 14.4, l, let's write down what we know, we'll write down m is equal to 14.4 in this formula, lower l limit is 12, n by 2 n by 2 is half of 20, which is 10, right? So n by 2 is 10. Cumulative frequency is 4 plus x, the frequency before the modal class, right? The frequency of the modal class is 5. And the interval, h, equals to 6. So all the values are known to us. We can substitute and find the unknown. So we have 14.4 equals to 12 plus 
n by 2 is 10 minus 4 plus x divided by 5 times 6. Okay. So this can be solved. Let's take 12 on the left side equals to let's open this bracket 10 minus 4 is 6 6 minus x over 5 times 6 so that gives us 12 point oh sorry 2.4 equals to 6 over 5 times 6 minus x so we get 5 over 6 times 2.4 equals to 6 minus x. Correct? So 6 times 4 is 24. So we get 5 times 0 0.4 equals to 6 minus x which is 5 times 4 20. So we get 2 equals to 6 minus x or x is equal to 6 minus 2 which is 4 for us. Correct? Once we have found x, we can easily find what y is. We know x plus y is 10. Since we know that x plus y is 10 and x is 4, so we get 4 plus y equals to 10. y equals to 10 minus 4, so y is equal to 6. So our answer is x equals to 4 and y equals to 6. Perfect. So that is how we can actually solve such a question. So I hope now you understand how to work with the median in a group data. Thanks for watching and all the best.